Hey everyone, this is Steve from Metaslider. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Metaslider to create powerful slideshows that you can use with Elementor. Metaslider is one of the most popular slideshow plugins in WordPress, and Elementor is one of the most popular page builder plugins. Together, they're a great combination. Let's see how they work together. I have a brand new WordPress site here. I'm going to go to the plugins area. I'll click add new plugin and I'll search for Elementor. I'll click install for Elementor and then I'll go and get Metaslider as well. There we go. There's Metaslider. I'll install that too. And then I'll go back to the plugin screen and activate both of those. Now I'm going to create a slideshow that I can use with Elementor. I'll go to the quick start area of Metaslider and I'm going to get some choices. A blank slideshow, an image slideshow, a carousel slideshow. I'm going to choose the image slideshow. And now we have the images and all the settings ready for us to go. If you want to get a quick idea of what the slideshow is going to look like, there's a preview option up in the toolbar. And what you see are horizontal images with arrows on either side. We can modify this later if you want to change the images or change the design. But for now, the key thing that we need is the short code in the bottom right corner. If you click on this area, it will automatically be copied and ready for you to use. My next step is to go and design a page with Elementor that I can add my slideshow to. I'll go to the All Pages area and I have an Elementor page ready to go. In the toolbar, I'll click on Edit with Elementor. And the key thing that I'm looking for when it comes to the Elementor layout is the shortcode option. I'll search for that and then drag and drop it into the main area. And what I'll do is just paste in the Metaslider shortcode that I grabbed a few moments ago. You'll be able to see a preview of your slideshow directly inside there. I will minimize that window and so you can see the full area available to the slideshow. This is likely to be different depending on what theme you're using. This particular theme does offer me the full width of the page. I'm going to click the Apply button now. And then down at the bottom, I'll click on the Update button. That will finally publish the page for me. And now I can go back to the toolbar at the bottom and click on the Preview Changes link. There we go. We now have an Elemental page with a good-looking slideshow in there. You can use the arrows to navigate this. And then you have a couple of ways to improve what you've started. If you want to change the images, change the design, add navigation, change the arrows, or modify the slideshow in any way, the quickest way to do that is to go to the Meta Slider link in the admin toolbar and click on Edit New Slideshow. Once you're in here, you can rearrange the images. You can decide to show or hide some of them on different screen sizes. You can change the width or the height. You can modify the theme. Let's take a look at what this particular theme called Bubble looks like. I'll select that theme. And there's all sorts of different changes you can make. I'll click on Save and then go back to my slideshow. Okay, so we have slightly different arrows now. Okay, what if I wanted to add some navigation at the bottom too? If I go to the navigation area, I can change that to dots. Okay, now we have some numeric navigation for the slideshow. What if I wanted to show multiple images at the same time? Well, I could put the slideshow into carousel mode. And the way that a carousel works is if the images are too small,
to take up the whole width of the screen, you'll see more than one image at once. So what I'll do is make the images a little smaller. And that should allow me to see multiple images at the same time. So if you do want to change the look and feel of your slideshow, go to Metaslider and Edit New Slideshow. And if you want to change the location and the layout of your slideshow, go to Edit with Elementor. And you can drag and drop all the different elements on the page. That's why using Elementor and Metaslider together is such a good combination. You have a really powerful slideshow carousel gallery plugin and you also have the most popular layout builder in WordPress. Both of these plugins are completely free to use. So if you haven't done so yet, head over to wordpress.org, grab your free copy of Elementor and also your free copy of Metaslider. Together, these are two of the most popular plugins in WordPress and they'll be a great combination for your WordPress website. Thank you.